Mighty warrior, great in battle, Jehovah is your name. Daddy, we thank you because you have shown yourself faithful. Indeed, you are Jehovah Almighty. A God that does not sleep, that does not slumber. A God that is faithful and true. A God that has kept us, sustained us, helped us. We are grateful. On behalf of our various families, we've come to say thank you. On behalf of our nation, Nigeria, we have come to say thank you. We've come to worship, to honor you, to exalt you, to magnify you. Daddy, thank you. Majesty. We worship your majesty. Unto Jesus be all the glory, honor, and praise. Majesty. Kingdom authority flows from his throne unto his own king of all kings we exalt we magnify that name of jesus glorify lift up on high christ jesus the king majesty we worship your majesty, King of all kings, Lord of all lords, we adore you. All hail, King Jesus. All hail, Emmanuel. King of kings, Lord of lords, bright morning star. And through all of eternity, we'll sing your praises. And forevermore, we will adore you. Emmanuel is here. Emmanuel is here. Emmanuel with us. Amen. 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 M A Ima Emmanuel with us A M M A Ima <laughs> The God that is with us Emmanuel we bless your holy name Thank you for your presence in our various families Thank you for upholding us Thank you for watching us Thank you for sustaining us Thank you that we are not in the bush Thank you that we are not in the wilderness Thank you that we didn't gather leaves as uh, matras in the bush or having a, a, a trunk for pillow <laughs> hey, daddy thank you we are not refugees somewhere daddy we thank you father we thank you in our nation there are refugees we pray for them lord even as we pray for ourselves we ask you lord god that let it be well with them we speak your peace so that they can be in their own homes too so that they can be settled live a normal life and for us that live a normal life let's be grateful let's be thankful it's a new month june the 6th january thank you jesus february thank you jesus march april may thank you jesus we are in june like i said earlier when you listen to the news it's like we know i've been here but blessed be the name of the lord god almighty he who has held us, he who has helped us, he who, who has, has visited us with his mercy. So don't wake up and complain. No food, no this, no that. Government say this one, that. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Let your thanksgiving be more. And if you are complaining at all, 
Ask God to tear off that garment of complaint. Ask God to remove that garment of heaviness. Ask God to remove that garment of displeasure. That you don't see good in your wife, in your husband, in your children, in your environment. Ah, no, no, no. Something is wrong. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Don't say it's okay for you. Is this for you? <laughs> this is how I started. We've been in this thing. Praying this morning prayers, 24 years plus now. And if you are just moving into this neighborhood and you ask somebody to tell this, she doesn't say anything more than thank you. Even while we, we are yet without an evidence of God's goodness, we're saying thank you. We're saying thank you. We're saying thank you. Father, we bless you. Father, we appreciate you. Why? Because we know that tomorrow will be better than today. <laughs> My bishop's best song, Bishop Daniel. Tomorrow's for me, brighter days ahead, light is shining on my path, for I have seen the light, I will rise and shine, Jesus is the light, tomorrow, tomorrow's for you, brighter days ahead, light is shining on a path, for we have seen the light, we will rise and shine. Jesus is the light. Abraham was called a friend of God. Romans 4, 17, because he called those things that be not as though they were. <laughs> he was not yet a father of many nations, but he caught up with the revelation of, he God, of God. And he said, call me Abraham, Father Abraham. <laughs> and in the children ministry, you cannot hear them singing. Father Abraham had many sons. Many sons had Father Abraham. Abraham, Abraham. I am one of them. And so are you. So let us praise the Lord. Then they say one hand, left hand, two hand, on my body. <laughs> and they'll be laughing at him. Father of many nations. But there, were, but there was nothing, nothing to show, nothing on ground, nothing on ground. I read. I'm telling you why you should be saying thank you, even if things were not okay for you. Be like our father Abraham. Yeah, I'm saying thank you because I have not yet started. <laughs> this one, a ministry warm up. <laughs> now warm up we did so we never enter them. And by God's grace, we shall enter the area. We fulfill our various destinies. Our destinies will not be cut off. We will not cry. We will not weep. We will not lament. We will not be homeless. We will not be childless. We will not be widows, widowers, orphans. No. Why? Because tomorrow's for us. Brighter days ahead. Light is shining on our path. For we have seen the light. We will rise and shine. Jesus is the light. <laughs> Jesus is our light. We'll rise and shine. But you can't rise and shine if you are not seen. So this morning, what are you seeing? Do you see God's goodness around you that will enable you to say thank you? I read Romans 4. Romans 4, from verse 16. Therefore, it is of faith that it might be by grace to the end of the promise might be sure to all the seed. Not to that only which is of the law, but to that also which is of faith, of the faith of Abraham, who is the father of all. The father of all. He is now the father of all. But it was not so in the beginning, but he held on to that promise. As it is written, Romans 4, 17, I read. As it is written, I have made thee a father of many nations. What are you believing God for? What did God promise you? What did he say to you? God said, as it is written, I have made thee that which God ordained. I've told you for me the best is yet to come. Yes, we have our own satellite on air. We have our own TV, free TV on. We'll have our own television station, radio station. We have, so you can see we have not yet started. 
church on the air is on already. We're already on radio. Yes, we're already on. On Facebook, we are there. YouTube, we are there. We we'll soon host our website so that anytime, any day, it's a worldwide web, worldwide television. Just press it, we are on. What did God tell you? As it is written, I have made thee that which God said to you. That ordained of him, his promise for you and for me. Before him whom he believed, you must believe, do you believe? The song says, tomorrow holds for me, brighter days ahead, light is shining on my path. Do you see the light? Or do you see gloom? Do you see? <laughs> I was somewhere yesterday, and then um, Mila entered the shop. The TV was on in the shop. I don't know, one of the Eastern governors was doing something. I don't know what, there was a rally. <laughs> and the person there said, look at him. He's always doing party, always doing parties, always partying. It was a live something yesterday afternoon. And then I look back, I said, me, I've stopped listening to television and radio, all these things. So I said, because I don't understand it. If you tune some radio stations, you hear some news, you go to YouTube, it's like, War is happening live and direct, like war everywhere. But look, this one a uh, live party, <laughs> and then somebody explained to me that what you have said is true. But the truth of the matter again is that in some part, yes, there is war going on. There's problem. There's crisis. Yes, gunshots. He said, "Let me even call for you." I said, "Don't call for me." He said, "So, but as God said." Some people are partying, doing parties, some are wedding, some are crying, some are burning their dead, some are this, some are that. So yes, it depends on the picture you want to see. Which picture do you want to see? Do you want to see that all is well? Second, focus on that which is well. Is it otherwise? Then you'll be having sleepless nights. He said, I have made thee that which God has ordained for you. For Abraham, he said, a father of many nations, before whom he believed, even God, who quickened the dead and collects those things which be not as though they were. So we are saying thank you, thank you. Don't say it's so good for you. Uh, uh, you are there now, up there now, up there now. Ask questions around. Before we became up here, <laughs> before we moved to the mountain, nothing, 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 nothing. But we called those things that be not as though they were. 18, who again so believed in hope that he may become the father of many nations according to that which was spoken, so shall their seed be. And be not weak in faith, he considered not his own body, but believed, he believed. 20, he staggered not at the promise of God through unbelief, but was strong in faith, giving glory unto God. Giving glory unto God. So this morning, give God the glory. Give God the praise. And if you are out there, you are too weak to say thank you. Ask God to forgive you. Ask God to have mercy on you. Ask God to open your eyes. Count your blessings. When you count your blessings, the pictures the devil is showing you, you find out that the one that God has done is much more than the one that he is showing you. And so, Father, we say thank you. Father, we say thank you. That he will bless your holy name. If you visit our YouTube channel under the banner of love account, you see a lot of videos there. <coughs> Excuse me. That we help to energize you, strengthen you, grow your faith. Above all, we grow our faith by the Bible. Pick up the Bible, read the Bible, stay on the word, stay on God's promises. And your life can never, never remain the same again.